for you on what is pretty close to an ideal evening for football. There is a barely a cloud evident. The world and his wife have gone to great lengths to be here for a match of great consequence and massive interest in these parts. Barely a breath of wind, so the football has no excuses for not being at its very best. The teams I know are pumped for this. They are fantastic scenes in the stands. There is a great sense of drama here, a great sense of excitement and expectation. The Emirates Stadium in all its glorious modernity, this symbol of new Arsenal, the Arsenal of the 21st century. And already we're underway here. Well, Peter, this is a game where I really don't think I need to spell out who I'm expecting to provide the sparks. The name is Diego Maradona, and not just footballing royalty, I think what's more appropriate is godlike. Yeah, the name itself strikes fear into the heart of opponents. What a player. Over to the left. Rudiger knocks it away. They've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Modric. Mohamed Salah goots it to safety. Hopper gets it back. That's one way of trying to make things happen. There's a few who could follow that example. Philippe Coutinho and it's Pogba oh, no that's not the ball he wanted aimed long and direct Kaya Hon it's gone for a throw in and it's hoisted clear Hazard spreads it towards the left. And it's Kaya Hon. And that's sprayed out wide. Crosses it in low. Arsenal have been pretty good down that left side, you know. Look, it's the width that's providing this momentum and, and they look set to further exploit. Well, the defence have two choices, deal with the man or, or deal with the space. And he's got good distance, who's chasing? Oh, that's nice. In towards the middle. And that's been levered clear. It's a good run down the left-hand side. Oh, that's nice. Good idea, just poorly executed. And that's a throw. Lobs it in gently. Maratona. And that has been clubbed away. Well, they're looking at the referee, but he's waved play on. Maradona unable to make it happen for all his good intentions. Maradona. Forward it goes. He's got options out wide. Luis can hoist it clear. The ball needed to be better there, it's a wasted chance. Barcelona have it back and they can go again. Luis positions himself well and cuts it out. There's a long ball. He's through the middle. And it's Messi. If you have just joined us, you'll be glad to know that you haven't missed a goal. Messi. 
by Hong. We'll try cutting inside here. Last-ditch defending, but that'll do. Now it's Modric. Modric. That's the throw. Oh, that's a foul in a dangerous area. Cuts it out. And it's half-time here. So both sides have drawn blanks. They have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. We'll do it back on the first 45 minutes. Well, this has proved a very frustrating day so far, especially for the strikers. Nothing has been created for them. I think the service has been extremely poor. Barcelona head to the dressing room, not yet having broken through. Tight cagey game. Now the team only further forward than they were when they started out. Already up and running for the second half. Barcelona, pretty fortunate not to be trailing at half-time. They've been lacklustre and... And the finish! Oh, good delivery, almost the perfect outcome. I have to commend the wing plate, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. Maradona. Just deflected behind for a corner. They've played it short. Modric plays it in. Vidal boots it to safety. Well, that's the first attempt, Peter, we've seen at one of those raking passes just to spread the play. Tries to get it forward quickly. Out wide to the right. Modric gets into the right position to intercept. Pogba plays it out to the wing. Great run on the overlap here. That is terrific skill. Coutinho tries lifting it over. Vince has got rid of that. Out to the left it goes. Now, can he capitalise? Well, it was a hefty deflection, but he's claiming it. Barcelona take the lead. Look, experienced voices need to be heard now, along with good purpose and urgency, and they can get right back into this. Forward it goes. 
Maradona plays it out to the flank. Messi. Now it's Messi. True. Looking to shoot. Meunier plays That's it forward. That's what has to be done now. No question about it. Well, hit and hope is just about the sum of it, isn't it, Jim? Well, there's no two ways about it. This is what they have to do. Now it's Hazard. Oh, the whistle's gone. What's he given? Well, the referee has given a free kick just outside the box. Yeah, well, they were exposed and, and vulnerable, and he knew he had to do something to prevent a goal then. Finish an absolute joy, and with that goal comes comfort. And he's produced a beauty. Barcelona grab a couple of goals without reply, it's 2 0. Well, unsurprisingly, Peter, the opposition look completely stunned. I'm not sure they can gather themselves. Well played, he saw that coming. Now it's Messi. Looking for a decent ball in. Cleared without complication. Breaks on here. Now it's Mohamed Salah. He's got away. It's Salah! In he goes again. And it's there! And they are pulling clear here. That's no fluke, it's what he was there for. Oh, Peter, you can't teach that. You either have it or you don't. His anticipation is on another level to everyone else's. Superb. Three without reply. This is becoming a stroll. No doubt as to who has the momentum here now. The only doubt is how many is coming. Aimed low and direct. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. So the ball's got out of play and a change is upcoming. Yeah, it's about time I think we saw some activity from the bench, but it's it's debatable as to what level of impact can be made from here. It's it's pretty late. Gets into some space. And he's got the ball glued to his feet. Drilled in low. Danger averted for now. And it's Salah. He's picked him out. Has a pop! And he should have made it for. Oh, look, I don't want to sound too dismissive, but from here, that looks the harder thing to do. The changes then in quick succession. Well, for me, this was the obvious substitution. He'd become just a little jaded, and as a result of that, he was most likely to make a mistake. I think sometimes when the body becomes tired, the brain goes with it, and I think that's happened in this case. Dennis Suarez. Now it's Modric. Oh, sweet feet. Well, to be honest, I think they're all showing no substance. Where's the final product? Messi. And it's Messi. Played back in. Over to the left. Denis Suarez.
Philippe Coutinho. Now it's Hazard. Modric. Coutinho looking to get on the end of this. He's left his man. Gets up to head it. Can have a follow up. On the pin for the pieces. Goal! He came, he saw, he delivered. He was really quick to react to the initial save, and he has his reward. Well, as they say, Peter, if you don't speculate, you won't accumulate. And we've just witnessed a player who was rewarded for his willingness to take a risk, as cunning as it comes. Barcelona tear their opponents apart once again. They are utterly ruthless. Aimed long and direct. Added time is up, and there goes the whistle. Barcelona, winners of a no contest. They just swap their opponents in superior quality. So, Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? Yeah, we knew there was a sizeable gap in the quality of both squads and, and the story was told in predictable fashion. Many thanks to Jim, and with that, it is a very good night.